So we want to solve this problem. We want to figure out where uh, what a has to be equal to in this composite function. So when we plug in 0 for x, we get 68 out. So to do this, I'm going to do f of g of x is going to be equal to 3 quantity 2x plus a squared minus 7 is equal to 68. And then we're going to solve for a after we plug in 0 for x. Or excuse me, no. We're going to just solve for a. So um, 3 times quantity. Oh, no, that's right. Never mind. We can plug in 0. So we get a squared minus 7 equals 68. So 3a squared um, is equal to, and then 68 plus 7 is going to be equal to 75. Divide by 3, divide by 3 a is equal to plus or well a squared is equal to um, 25 and then a is equal to plus or minus 5 so let's try that out um, 3 times 2 times 0 minus 5 squared minus 7 I all I did is I plugged in 0 because it's crossing the y-axis and equationally crosses the y-axis at x equals 0 so 3 times negative 5 squared minus 7. So this is 3 times 25 minus 7. So 75 minus 7, which is equal to 68. So A equals plus or minus 5 checks out. That's it.